got a good one with like a lad called like really well known, well, well known. Banter. So Cherno Samba. Yeah, I don't remember. So you talk Samba. about banter and stuff like this. So Cherno Samba, like, was obviously he's at Millwall, been linked with like moves to Liverpool, or whatever. When he was young, million yeah. pound, whatever. So he come into he come into Plymouth, didn't he? I remember. Yeah. But he weren't all there, like really. He was a bit like slow with it. He was a bit one of them, like where. <laughs> You could have him off a little bit. He probably wouldn't know you're getting him like and things like that. And we had like people involved, like older lads in the dressing room that was like the banter side of it. And they're yeah. like, do you know what I mean? He was younger. We same age as me. We had a we had a physio at the time called Paul Maxwell. Maxie's like love him, like real good friend of mine. Like, but just he's clever, like and he's quick. So he knew when like to have people on. Did everything right when he was meant to do it. Did everything right. So we're training one day, and like um, Churns gets like knocked. I can't remember if he got. I can't remember if he got the ball in his face or he got a little elbow or something yeah. like that, but he rocked his jaw a little bit. <laughs> so he's complaining about his jaw for the rest of the training. Comes up, obviously we're all getting showered, changed, whatever, like going to go for food. We all have like big green room where we used to all, all eat. And uh, so we, uh, he'd gone into Maxi and gone like, oh, like um, my jaw is killing me. Like I said, like, can you have a look at it? But he was seeing, I think he was seeing, what I think it was Watsy at the time. Watsy was in the injury room with him. Maxi was one of them quite ruthless, just telling you to fuck off out. If it, like, do you know what I mean? He had no time for anyone. If you weren't injured, he fucking tell you ain't injured. And But Churns, you could get on him a little bit. And Maxi was all about banter and like funny for the lad. So he sent Churns away. He said, look, come back in 10 minutes. So he, he obviously fucks off out. And then I think like between Watsy and Maxi, <laughs> And then Churns has called Churns back in like 10 minutes later and he's gone like, come on, let's have a look at you, lad. And he's a bit dopey, Churns. Won't really get what he's being had off. And like Max, he's having a look at him, looking at his chin and stuff like that. He's gone, oh my God, lad. He said like, we need to do something about this. And Churns has gone like, what, what's the matter? Like, I thought something was wrong. He said like, you've got um, drop jaw syndrome. <laughs> <laughs> and so like Watsy's like, Watsy tells a story about it because he was sat on the bed with him. And like all of us were eating at this time. So like, and what she's like, he said like, so Maxie's like going, yeah, like he said, if we, unless we treat this now, like, he said like, this, is, this could be serious, but if we treat it now, it should be all right, but it's quite serious. So Chan's like, all right, so he said, so right, he says, Chan's like, right, let me just get some tape in that here. So he's gone into his medical thing. He's got out one of these like, you know, the bandages you get yeah. in like, uh, like hospital and stuff like that. Yeah. And it's meat as long. It's meat as long, this thing. He's pulled out the whole ravel, like, and he's gone, like, churns, hold that bit under your chin there. So he's got in a thing. He's wrapped this bandage <laughs> round his head, honestly, I swear, down about 200 times. This bandage <laughs> looks like he's got, like, fences on it. <laughs> it's, like, all round his head here, like this. Taped it all round as well. Right. Churns could hardly see out of it by the end of it. He's got <laughs> yeah. this massive thing. And he's gone, right, you'll be all right. And I've got to leave it on for a couple of hours, though. So Chan's like, right, sound. He went, go down and get your lunch. <laughs> so oh, so he's what? come down, honestly, like, <laughs> uh, we're, everyone's eating. I've, like, spat my food out. I'm, like, fucking <laughs> screaming, like, laughing. Yeah. I'm, like, what the fuck are you doing, Chan's? <laughs> and he come back in, still didn't know it was a joke. And he's like, oh, no, I've got a uh, drop joint. <laughs> and all the boys are looking at each other, what the fuck are you talking about? <laughs> And with that, like, obviously, Maxie's come down and, like, he's he's carried on playing oh, it. He's carried on playing the game a bit. <laughs> Churn just kept it on for, must have been fucking boiling. Must have kept it on for probably another fucking hour until Maxie's, like, broke down and all the boys are, like, fucking jumping on each other. No way. He was just one of those kids that you could just, like, you tell him saying he believes it. <laughs> and he's, he's got him with that. Honestly, the bandage, I've, got, I've pictured that in my head, like, it's just, the bandage was fucking massive. And if it was someone else, if he'd done that to me, I'd be, like, looking in the mirror again. Yeah, fuck off, Max. Yeah. Like, <laughs> yeah. fuck off, lad. There's no way this is real. And he was just, he was just one of them kids. But there's, like, architect, million of the stories like that, mate. Football's just built on yeah. the lads yeah, fucking about. Brilliant. 